What's going on YouTube? My name is Diesel and today we're in a brand new game called Parkosaurus. We're doing theme parks and dinosaurs. Oh, Parkosaurus is a zany dinosaur park management game that challenges the player not only to provide guests with a unique dinosaur zoo experience, but to care for their dino friends by crafting the perfect exhibits, gifting them the cutest hats what and traveling back in time to rescue them from their demise oh my goodness um this is like if jurassic uh, jurassic world evolution had content i'm just playing i'm playing but i'm not i'm not i'm not playing you can build your own parks you can customize them to your own specific liking as you can see in the steam workshop here that's coming soon you can add mods and different things to it uh creators create and we shall enjoy uh it is actually going to be out on steam today on the 25th I believe it'll probably launch, if it's anything like any other game, it'll be like 11 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. So take that Eastern Standard Time and apply it to wherever you may live. Let's do it. Let's go hop into a brand new game. Let's, 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 let's get some dinosaurs. All right. No achievements or dino book in sandbox mode. Oh. Well, let's go back. Let's do a standard game then. I want achievements. I want to I wanna have unlockables. Alright, so skip tutorial and intro. Um, I've not played this yet. I've not messed around with it, so uh, I might have to uh, check out the tour. Let's look at this place though, man. Can I zoom out? No? Okay. I may have to do a tutorial quick. If so, if it's not entertaining, I'll, I'll just cut it out. It'll be fine. Dinosaurs. They, they came to Earth in a rocket ship. They crashed and they had helmets. They're adorbs. They have googly eyes. All right. What is the name of your park? Diesel Dino Fun. Oh. Diesel's Dinos. Boom. Ha <laughs> ha. Commander Ollie here. It's nice to meet you, human. Welcome to your first dinosaur park. I will be looking into ways we can enhance the well-being of our dinosaur friends. This looks like a big empty area to set up a, uh, our dinosaur park. There's quite a lot of garbage around, but every great dinosaur park has to start somewhere. But first things first, navigating around the park is easy and important. Let's give it a try. Okay, let's go ahead. We'll give it a try. Let me guess. W-A-S-D. <laughs> Let me guess. If I want to rotate, it's Q and R. Oh my god. Groundbreaking. But pan the camera. Pan the camera. Hold down the right mouse button to pan the camera. Oh. Oh, look at this. Okay, so right, gotcha, right mouse key, good job, oh, well, thank you, I'm a natural. Your first exhibit, Science Officer Luca, reporting for duty, it's almost time to meet your first dinosaur. I'm excited to see how their biological systems function in this atmosphere, but let's not get ahead of ourselves. Commander Ollie said we should get set up, oh, we should set up an exhibit first, okay. Exhibits are where your dinos live. Your design exhibits to match your dino's needs and to increase dino happiness. For now, let's create a simple exhibit for your first dino. Select the wood fence to build the exhibit. You got it, sir. Select the wood. Oh, I got wood, bro. Bro, click on fences and doors, then click the wood fence. Left click the ground to start building an exhibit. Finish placing your fence where you began. You got it, man. Bang, bang. We got wooden fences. And you just drag and drop. Actually, you don't even need to hold it. Just click. Click. Boom. Ha boom. We got concrete fences, too. Nice. And doors. Doors. Need a door. Guess we'll put a door there. We can kind of zoom in here. Okay. We got mail. Packs here. I piloted the crash ship into the planet. Your money is very shiny. We should really be collecting as much of that stuff as possible. I invented a way to collect these coins. In bins called donation boxes from packs. Okay, good. Also, we're working on the, do the, do the donation system here. Okay. It's trees, parks. Aha. So, buildings, facilitar, donation box. There we go. So, we got a donation box. It's a, a trust system. Let's get you your first dinosaur. This is a very exciting for everyone involved from Ollie. Ha! <laughs> Ollie's got a little graduation cap. He's smart. We got Stegosaurus or Triceratops. Triceratops, sir. Okay. Open the inventory. Click on your egg and place inside your exhibit. Okay. Inventory. Oh, we got an inventory bag here. Huh. 
Okay. Do we have to water it? <laughs> Do we have to sit on it for a little bit? Town is a great place to buy food, accessories in uh, for your dinos, or get loans. You can visit town anytime during the day, even at nighttime, from PAX. Click on the town at the top of the screen, click on the vegetable store, and purchase six plants and buy down. Okay, so we got to go to the town. Oh, look at this. What else? We got gems, eggs, hats, oh goodness, hats, and meat. All right. There's a medium quality food for dinosaur vegetarians. Food is placed in the feeder by the veterinarian. Okay. There's a medium quality food for dinosaur vegetarians. Food is placed. Okay. What's, so what's the difference? We've got plants and plants, plants and more plants. Charge daily, cheaper. Oh, okay. Well, I'll say we get it right now because we don't have any. We don't have any people coming in here. Four, five, six. All right. Killing the game already here. Got an office. Oh, check this out. Office. A portal. It's like a Stargate. Oh, okay. So apparently we go back in time and then we can uh, save the dinosaurs. Look at this tree. Wow. Wow. Good stuff. Okay. Vegetables. Yum, yum. There are many different types of dino feeders. Upgrading and researching new dino feeders gives various bonuses to your dinos. The new dino is a vegetarian, so let's get a vegetarian feeder. Okay, well, why not? Uh, let's go ahead. Here. This is this is uh, messing me up because I'm always used to seeing like this on top of the circle, so I'm um, not the one in front, so I just got to learn. Got to learn. Small vegetarian feeder. We'll put it next to the uh, next to the walkway here, so people can see him. People can see him feeding. Just basically see them in general. Caring for your dino best friends is a lot of work. Employees are a great are a great help by doing many of the tasks in the park. Veterinarians are the primary caregivers for your dinos. Let's hire a veterinarian. Okay, let's do that. Let's go ahead and hire them. Go to the office. Resumes. Okay. Talil. He's speedy. He's got kind of low abilities, personality. He's kind of lame. Anybody else? Choose. Tooth, news and tooth. <laughs> 14 speed, 3 ability, 4 personality. A little more expensive. 13 speed, 2, 2. This is for Rich the Sixth. I don't care for Rich. Let's hire Tooth. Work ethic, assign tasks. You can assign the tasks of your employees. Okay, you can always look up the information again in the Dinopedia, located in the office. Okay. Watch veterinarian fill feeder. Oh, look at this. Oh, you're doing just a fantastic job. The exhibit painting is a great tool to inspect the type of biome and biodiversity in your exhibit. Every dino species has a particular biome they prefer to live in. You can create a biome in your exhibit by place, uh, first placing a base tile. And then morph the biome by modifying the wetness and terrain. Real oh, so we can just turn the whole biome? Oh, we can turn the whole part of the park to a biome. That's fantastic. Click the fence or double click the ground uh, in the exhibit to open up the exhibit pane. Okay. Drag grass tiles to, file, uh, to fill the exhibit. Okay. Terrain tool. Oh, look at that. I would really like. There we go. Let's spread it. Spread it out. Spread it on. There we go. It's a forest biome, y'all. Morph biome. Okay, so let's go ahead. Water tool. Place water. Often essential tool. Okay, so we gotta place. Oh, look at this. Oh, so we can create a little lake for him. Oh, nifty. Oh, that's fantastic. They're gonna love that. Okay, I thought I did that. Let's see, biome. What, do I need to add more? Place water often essential for exhibit. Uh, okay, 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 okay. I'm just trying to have a little bit. 
There we go. We need to add more water, apparently, according to them. Mail call. Every biome has an ideal ratio of trees to bushes to rocks. This ratio is called the exhibit biodiversity and contributes to your dinosaur's habitat score. Trees, bushes, and rocks can only live in particular biomes. Note that trees and bushes often need to be near water sources. Thanks, Holly. All right, so build trees and suitable things. Why not? Boop. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah, let's put it let's, let's put it around there. Look at that. Good, 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 good. Now we need bushes, bushes. This is wild, man. Build rocks to your next exhibit, so now we'll grab some rocks. Uh, I'm pretty sure we don't need to have those near anything. Ooh, that's some rocks. Some silly little tiny rocks. Nice. Good, good. Time to open the park so guests can visit. You can close your park at any point. Just remember, guests give donations and buy tickets. Technically, you can see it from the road. But look at this. Oh, it's so good. It's adorable. The Triceratops. It's adorable. Yeah, he's super happy. All right. Okay, so what do I do? Click on the emission booth. Let's open the park. It's midnight. Who cares? Oh, it says 6.55. The janitor is a key member of your staff. A janitor can repair fences, pick up garbage, empty toilets, and more. A janitor automatically does tasks around the park, such as picking up garbage. Go to the office and hire a janitor. Now, I uh, have seen in the trailers for this game... That these dinosaurs can get loose, and if they get loose, then you go into first-person mode, and then you just sh you shoot them down with a trank dart. You don't kill them, you just shoot them with a the trank dart. But it's like a Call of Duty moment, for sure. Janitor. Alright. We have Bata. Hello, Bata. 14, 3, and 4. 20 bucks. <laughs> okay. Crony. Crony. I already like you, sir. 13, 4, and 5. <clears throat> Beacus. Heavy on the personality, not so much on everything else, which means he probably smokes a lot of pot. Uh, let's see. Sikundusse. I don't like your name, so therefore I'm not going to hire you. Corvus. Personality, 22. Speed. Out of all of them, they, this one's got the best stats, but the speed. I will hire you. They're crony. Crone. Hey, Janner. You got yourself a little bit of, little bit of time. A little bit of things to do. Okay, watch janitor clean three out of three. Pick up and move the janitor so we can pick him up. And boom, there we go. See, we're learning. And he's going to clear some junk. This has been a lot of park training. Let's have guests arrive to the park to make some money. Okay. Now, you can also add lights, and it's actually a pretty interesting thing to see. Have zero five guests visit your park. Well, I certainly hope so. Is there a way to speed up time? If I could speed up time there is oh check this out you can always look up information again in the, the dinopedia looking in the office okay so we got charts the end of the day is a good time to look at the aspects of your park hearts are rewarded at the end of the day for every dinosaur that is happy or super duper happy okay we're super happy zero donations we just opened the park have zero five okay so we need to earn thirty dollars and at least get five people in here Hearts gain, zero. Science gain, nothing. Next day. Oh, and it's saved for us. Fantastic. Building colors. I'll go with yellow. Yellow, white, black. Orange. Whoa, 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 see, see, the Triceratops getting a little little antsy. Hey man. Hey man, you, you chill hand hey man. He's getting rammy. He's got a got a little rammy. <laughs> it's like, hey buddy. Oh check this out, we got people. 
I want to see the Triceratops. Can I go up and pet the Triceratops? There we go. Earn $25. We need one more person. Looks like this guy's going to be the winner. Nice. Making us sell some sweet, sweet paper, baby. Nice. Nothing has ever gone wrong in a dinosaur park, especially movies about dinosaur parks. This is true. 100% true. Trust me. Just in case, how about we give our security some practice in case some of your dinosaur best friends decide to adventure outside your exhibit? Learn to tranquilize a dinosaur. All right. If we must. If we must, we must. Security. 13 speed. We got Yaraj. Can we, can we rename these guys? No. Anfelhoof. Hey, hey, my name is Anfelhoof. I don't know. Sounds German. Sounds like a perfect security guy. Reno, 14, 4 and 4. Reno. It'll be perfect. Click on dinosaur. Click on the request tranquilization button located at the dinosaur info pane. What? Request. Huh? Click on the dinosaur. Click on the request tranquilization. Oh, okay. So we do that. Oh, it's over here. Reno's already on the way to tranquilize Millie. Oh. Oh my god. Hey, Reno. Okay. So we tranked her. Him. Click on your tranquilized dinosaur. Okay. So we caged him. Open the inventory. Click on your dinosaur crate and place inside your exhibit. But... Okay, so we just tranked the poor dinosaur just to show us how to do it. Okay, okay. Let's explore the world of science. I mean, they'll be he's gonna be fine. You know, he'll be fine. Let's uh, explore the world of science. Science credits are used in the science tree to unlock useful upgrades the items for your park. The most common way to generate science credits to is to have scientists work at a science building or at a scientist presentation. Luca, build a science building. Well, okay then. I will. Research. Science. I take it that we need to have... Oh, look at this. There we go. You can always look up... Okay, okay. Pick up scientists. Pick up your scientists by selecting the... Oh, we have to hire a scientist first. And then place onto science node. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, so we need a scientist. Hey, scientist. Hey, janitor. Hey, scientist. Scientist. We have Kieran. Gamuni. Synchroth. What a name. Kortai. And Pierden. I like Kortai. He's got some solid stats. I don't, like the pro I don't know what pro how well the employees interact with guests. I don't, care. I don't need my scientists to interact with guests. I need them... To do a task. Oh, look at that. Five and four. It just slows balls. Kortai. Scientist. Kortai's already here, man. Boom. All right, so we got some research going on here, baby. Let's go ahead and we'll make this pretty, oh so pretty. <laughs> All right, so we're generating seven out of twenty science today. Good. Look at the money that we're making in here, man. People are just mesmerized. Now, what's our what's our dinosaur's name? Millie. Oh, we can change the name of our dinosaurs. Looks like Patreon supporters are gonna get their gonna get their fill. Nice, nice, nice. Oh my god, hold on. Time to expand the park with more dinosaur best friends. Use the portal to go dig up skulls and footprints to be used in the egg store. What? Alright, so we'll have to name him later. We gotta go we gotta go back in time. We gotta get Kurt Russell in here. Open up the portal. Select the time period below the portal to determine what dino parts to dig. Use your current scientist to dig for skulls and footprints. Each of your scientists have a unique dig type. 
I was not aware of that. I was not aware of the dig type when I hired him, to be honest with you. Have expedition team arrive at the dig site. Exploring takes a little time, so explore your park and return later. Oh, okay. So he's got to go from there to there. All right. So they've arrived. They'll, they'll, they'll arrive in a little bit. Okay. Whoa! It's amazing! Okay. I'm just making sure. Because it's flashing at me. If it's flashing at me, I don't know. I can get a little, get a little nuts. We have fences. What else we got here? We got street lights. Look at that. Oh, that's pretty now. Now, we can really customize these things uh, really, really nicely. As a matter of fact, these chain lights, once we unlock them, you can actually hook up these lights and then drag the chain lights to go all the way across. It's pretty wild, man. I digs it. I like this. This is nice. It's calm. Paths. Keys. Okay. Um, where's our janitor at? Hey, janitor, can you clean this stuff up? Oh, okay. Remove tool item. Hold alt to remove from selection. Okay. Are we there yet? Have expedition team arrive at the dig site. Exploring takes a little time. Okay. To you, Mr. Krishlau. Here we'll, we'll name it Justin for Mr. Justin Krishlau. It's Justin. Hold on. Is that a is this a male or female? Can we minus this. Enter Dino Cam. Oh look, we got dino dinosaur cams, baby. Oh, this is fantastic. Oh, we sleep. He sleep! Oh, he leaking! No, he sleep! No, he's fine. He's fine. Shh. Let's let him get his seeds. How do I get out of this mode? <laughs> Help! There we go. Uh, progress closing in four seconds. Cool. How much money do we rake in? Tip money. Very good. Exit. Oh. Five hundred forty-seven donations. Ticket sales one hundred seventy-seven hundred seventeen dollars. Not a bad first day for one dinosaur. Hmm. Mm -mm. So we gained one heart and 140 science. Diesel's Dinos, two stars, rating 2.5. We'll boost that up. Park appeal, 111. Balance, attendance. Income, oh, hold on. Boop. You know, it's pretty in-depth, too, man. Like, it gives you a very... There's Justin. <laughs> Hello, number one, no hit show. Uh, guess buildings. Oh, look at this. Devin stock, staff, hire and fire them. We won't do any of that right now, though. To the next day. Save complete. Wednesday, spring. Springtime, the only steady rain time. Birds sing, ending. Your expedition has arrived. Sweet love, us love. All right, return to the portal. Click on the dig button. Click on a scientist. Click on the dig site to remove dirt. Be careful. Find. Okay, so dig. Oh, oh, we found it. Found ourselves another one. We got ourselves another one. And we're out. Our tools are gone. Okay. So now we have to hop into the veg vegetables. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I'll tell you what. Add to daily. How many of these do we need? Kind of didn't show me. Uh, this is an alpha, by the way. Just want to throw that out there. Oh, well, we got eggs. Oh, look at this. All right, so two and two. A perfect gem. Okay, create. Excuse me. That's not how dinosaurs are made. They're made in, in a lab. With all kinds of weird things going around it. Nice. 
We got ourselves another Triceratops egg. Oh, we got ourselves another Triceratops egg. We'll get we'll get Justin the, a, a friend. Need more DNA. Okay, so we inject the uh, chickens with our DNA that we found in our star game. The chicken then uh, craps out an egg, and now we got new friends. We got all kinds of new buddies. Remember the science credits. What are the what are they? Science, what is it good for? Let me tell you, science, science credits, say it again now. Ah, are used to unlock science technology such as new buildings, upgrades, and perks. Go to the science tree to unlock the science technology tree. All right, okay. So we have uncommon gents. Okay, so horticulturist, amateur, how dare you. We have sous chef. Now what is this like? Oh, it's a taco. Oh, this shows us what we unlock. Okay, boxed laurel, boxed laurel corner, potted fern. Tom's wonton truck, delicious. Oh, and we unlock a fedora. Watch out, Rat Pack. Here we come. Uncommon gem. Gems are used to create dino eggs. More can be found in the gem store. Oh, but it takes six hundred uh, science credits, which we don't have yet. Smart water to unlock your employee potential at play building. Okay. Science, learn, unlock research. Stone science presentation. Cool glasses. <laughs> well, I think we all know where I'm going to go here. We need ourselves some fancy glasses. Some fancy glasses. And pretty soon we're going to be up to 300 and we can unlock that tree. And then we've unlocked this part of the tree, which gets us to a garbage bin. We're Captain Planet. Stone science presentation. Good, good. Man, this goes this goes on long, man. Oh, this goes a while. Look at our science. <laughs> I dig this game, man. This is pretty wild. Well, I've taught you everything I know about being a good dinosaur park manager. There's much more to explore, but you're on your own to gaining the park fame and becoming a great park manager. And that's from Ollie. Thank you, Ollie. Well, I'll tell you what, sirs and ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children, children of all ages. Let's go ahead. We're gonna pop in. Our triceratops again so that Justin has himself a little buddy and I think this is a great place for us to end the episode so folks if you enjoy this video and you want to see more we're definitely gonna be playing a bunch more of this game because it's fantastic it is pretty wild and look Justin's just he's going over to get some berries he's going through the berries now, I wonder if they get bigger I can only assume that they will because they're tiny they're super duper tiny but it's wild, man. Hold on. Oh, yeah. Oh, he he's angry. He's vicious. He'll be fine. He's adorable. He's totes adorbs. Justin, you're such a smoocher. I'll tell you that much, man. The ladies love you. Oh! You growl. You growl, big man. Everyone's just so happy. Everyone's so happy. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. But, folks... We're going to be playing a bunch more of the uh, uh, Park Source here uh, in the upcoming days. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Let me know if you have any hints, tips, or tricks that you might have seen from any other YouTuber because I'm pretty sure that they're going to be playing it as well. And I'm always down. I'm always down to get more experience, more dinosaurs, more parks, more science. So everyone, if you enjoyed this video, by all means, hit that like button. It helps out my channel ever so much more than you know. And if you like it a whole lot, go ahead, hit subscribe. New videos coming out every single day, every single week, folks. Have a great day, afternoon, evening, a good night. Peace out, I shout y'all. And I will check you out right here again in Parkasaurus next time.